This is Twit. Uh, well, we're talking about uh, those voice assistants. There was some actually good news. It's kind of funny because you and I were talking about this on iOS Today, Micah. Mm -hmm. um, it came out first that Amazon, if you use the Echo, third-party people might be listening. And it turns out this is what every voice assistant does because this is how they improve it. Right. They take a percentage, a small percentage of the recordings and have humans say, well, does that match? Have to train it. You have to train it. Mm -hmm. So then we heard Google, oh, yeah, we do it too. And then recently Apple came out. Although you say that the original article named Apple, but nobody paid attention until The Guardian wrote an article about it like three <laughs> weeks later. Wow. But then they paid attention. Well, now Apple, Google, and Amazon have all said, okay, we're going to give you ways to turn it off. Apple's actually said we're no longer going to use humans to grade. And the reason that was an issue, I think it's not unreasonable to think that they're going to do that for training, but the reason... It was an issue. Is this ever? Do you use voice assistants? In your I house? do every now and then. Well, and I does every it. now and then one of them wake up for no apparent reason? Sure. My <laughs> Siri does. My home hub is always talking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the problem is that means it heard something it thought was hey sh Shlomo right. and hey sh <laughs> you know who <laughs> and uh, started recording and sending it back and then try to interpret it. That uh, it, uh, those are some of the recordings that might be sent to humans. Yeah. And who knows what that heard. Right. Like a passionate tryst. <laughs> I don't know who she is, but she's welcome in my house anytime. Oh, my dear friend, passionate, passionate, passionate tryst. tryst. That's my chat handle. Uh, like a passionate <laughs> tryst, actually. You're right. Or an argument. Yeah, or, yeah. you know, who knows? The secret code to my bit. Right. Coin locker. I don't know. Right. <laughs> You'd like that information. I would, please, yeah, you if would. you know Siri, <laughs> send it to me. <laughs> don't rub it in, Mike. <laughs> it's painful. Um, so anyway, this is not new. Well, we knew this. The, I, there are two takeaways from this. One is that these companies are really a bunch of weasels. They don't have <laughs> they don't have morality till they're caught. Right. And then suddenly they're like, right. Oh, it's gonna... very Facebook of them. Right. So and, yeah. and and it's and it's true of all of them. And the fix is very simple. They just make it opt in. Mm -hmm. If you want, you know, you, mm -hmm. as you're setting it up or whatever, they're going to say, "Do you mind if we do this?" X Y Z. Some browsers already do that, and you just choose yes or no, and that's the end of it, and it'll be fine. But if we expect to get optimal performance out of these voice assistants we need better we training need, they need to train it yeah that's you know? part of the process yes. well they need to make a case maybe and and so they could make that case to say look we'd like to make this better you could help us make it better if you right. opt in but let we should you should know one percent of the recordings might be heard by humans we'll do our best to anonymize make that it. opt in large enough for everybody to see it perhaps you know that everybody, <laughs> nobody will opt in. <laughs> That's the problem. You're, yeah, you're worried they'll just They know that too. Skip yeah. over it. Some people like it when they, other people are tuning into their passionate <laughs> tryst. So... <laughs> That's going to really Look, color. Gonna, yeah, no you're judgment. Young. That's no judgment. your thing. That's fine. Yeah, but uh, that's going to mean Siri is really kind of kinky. Yeah, well. So we know. don't want that. We want, I mean, this is part of the problem, too, is what you're training this stuff with affects right. the yep. quality of the stuff. And if only people who like to be, I like to be watched, are going to let Siri watch, then that's not going to give you People complain so much about the performance of Siri and, and, I'm thinking if you don't let people train it, you right. can't complain about it. This is Apple's problem. They are support. They want to be private. Yeah. That means Siri's never going to be as good as the other guys who don't mind spying on you. I think that there will be nerds who aren't so much. I think there's like, there's a, there's a mid nerd. And I kind of consider myself in that group <laughs> because there's a far nerd right. and the far nerd is like, I will never let any sort of Wi-Fi thing in my house. I don't even let my dogs get on the internet, but a mid nerd <laughs> like me, I'm okay with Siri hearing the passionate Triss. No, I'm okay Wait, with what? Siri hearing, uh, and well, being, honestly, getting better. Who cares so if yes. somebody hears that, that you don't know far away and they, well, some people do and that's fine. I'm just saying I'm okay with that. So I think you're going to have a nice group of mid nerds. What's the as, next as you let your dogs use yes. the internet? What's the high far nerd? nerd. Far, far nerd. nerd. Yeah. Far nerd. I'm a far nerd. I turn every time you it say says no to everything. I say yes to everything. <laughs> then that's mid nerd. <laughs> no, that's, you're a near nerd. No, there's got to be another nerd then. What's the I'm, one where you don't have any <laughs> concerns at all? Oh, that's the non nerd. No, I'm oh, a, this, he's clearly a, nerd. Like a regular consumer. Yeah, that's a regular <laughs> consumer, but you're you're mid nerd. You know, but you say yes anyway. That's the regular consumer. I want to be a special nerd. Okay, see, he doesn't just want to oh, be right yeah. in the middle. <laughs> All right, there's the Leo nerd. There's the Leo who will 
uh, every time you, it says, would you like to send uh, information back to app developers, help them make it better? That's one of the check yeah. marks. I say, yeah. You do? Yeah, that's Absolutely. what you're doing. Absolutely. Yeah. Every time. You turn that off? It depends on what I'm using. What a selfish son no, of a it guy. it depends on what... <laughs> well, I, I also don't selfish. send it to developers. <laughs> I'll send it back to the... To Apple, but I don't do the developer one. Really? Yeah, yeah we right. talked about this a little bit on iOS today because there, it's the way that they collect it for developers that makes mm -hmm. me uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. um, the the crashes and things like that go through, from what I've been told, a different system than the way that Apple gets the data back, and I'm not trustworthy of the company that helps with that uh, oh, sending to developers. There's so a that's disconnect. why I say Again, no on developer one. I don't care. So yep. you're you're a Leo nerd. I'm the peak yeah. under my kimono nerd. <laughs> Um, no, that's not good. <laughs> I don't like that one. <laughs> but part of it depends on what you do for a living and what your life is like. So you're... I'm on camera every day. You're everything. Like, yeah. you're, you're very uh, open in public. But if you were in financial services or if you were... Oh, yeah, I respect that. If you were, if you were a drug dealer or if you stole tires for a living... Or By the way, all three are the same profession. Exactly. It's, okay. it's a fine line. Yeah. Uh, between that and podcasting, but I mean, I, I think a lot. I think a lot of people. You know, so, some people are, you know, they're they're psychiatrists or whatever, and they they really have to have a lot of privacy, Wouldn't and it, that makes a lot of sense. In yeah. a way, it's ironic because if somebody's hearing anything, I any passionate trysts of mine, they're going to recognize my voice, possibly. Oh, that's right. true. I mean, oh, listen, to what I got from Leo. That's true. And, that and the really kind of people who no. are yeah. who are looking at these things are the kind of people who would be, who would be listening, listening and watching it? to this podcast. Could you send me those recordings? <laughs> uh, and if you if you hear my Bitcoin wallet password go floating through, please.